Hey there guys, what is up? Welcome back to the channel today. We are back in a state of Corsa, but the graphics are insanely maxed out. If you guys want to comment below on how I got such graphics, I left some details down in the comments below. But for now, let's just jump straight into the gameplay. We're in the Honda S2000 and this thing looks absolutely amazing. Um, We have some paddles on the road. I am running the rain effect mod. Um, the show called Ray mod and exactly and I'm not gonna lie this the mod looks absolutely amazing the clouds are so exactly I think those are the so clouds I have running on and oh my god this game looks absolutely amazing even the donuts I even got a chance to do donuts look at those look at how cool they look <laughs> I, I just had to do donuts I mean if you do drive the S2000 you have to do donuts in it but I'm not gonna lie, I've been enjoying playing this game more and more ever since I actually started learning how to actually properly mod it. It's been a pure joy. Um, and these roads are just absolutely amazing. They really add to the immersion of the game. Ooh. It doesn't really help my cocaine addiction to be honest, because like I was thinking like I really need to delete some of my car mods because I have way too many cars in this game, but it's so hard. Every time I try to delete a car, I always think like, oh, what if I need it in the future? And that's how you end up with like more than 500 mods in a game. But as for now, the game looks absolutely beautiful to be honest. I actually like this. So I was using the T300 RS4. If you're wondering which wheel I was using, this is the T300. Absolutely feels amazing to drive it and I actually enjoy using it. And the force feedback also feels amazing. Ooh, bit of traffic there, but nothing I can handle. I like how even in the traffic you have motorcycles. I mean, for a game that was made like in 2014, Assetto Corsa really sets the bar pretty high up there. So, this is if you haven't played this game, you definitely have to try it. If you're on console, I'm sorry, you can't fully enjoy the game. It has to suck. I'm pretty sure Seto Corsa is one of those games that absolutely sucks playing on console because you can you play it to its full extent. But oh look, he was going for an overtake. I oh I almost crashed it there. But this was absolutely amazing to do. Uh, oh and yep, that's bound to happen. I think it's time we change into another car. Uh, welcome back. We are now in the Bugatti Chiron. This is the Andrew Tate mod. If you haven't tried it out. Please try it out, it's an amazing mod, I love it. We are on Union Island, just before the sun sets. I love, I love the aesthetics this island has. It looks absolutely beautiful. Oh my god. It feels like I'm actually in real life driving this thing, I'm not gonna lie. And oh my god. I absolutely love this game to be honest. The more I've played this game, the more I've literally fallen in love with it. How do you top something like this? I was, I was saying the exact same thing. I was thinking like, imagine if they decide to like make an Assetto Corsa 2. Like, how the hell do you top all of this? Look at this. Look at the sun. Oh my god, this looks absolutely beautiful. This is giving me Test Drive Unlimited vibes so much. Oh my god. This is giving me some Test Drive mods. I mean, how the hell do you top off a game like this? I've actually been enjoying playing this way too much. Oh my god. The Bugatti looks nice. It feels nice to drive. Last time I drove this thing, it was super sketchy, but someone in the comments uh, told me what I had to do. Someone actually commented what I had to do, so I had to change some of the tire pressure and stuff like that to get the car to feel absolutely... to feel a bit normal, but now it feels pretty great. I don't know how to describe it, but it feels pretty great. And look at those graphics, oh my god. Oh, this looks absolutely amazing. I swear to god, uh, I'm sorry for swearing to god, I'm sorry. I swear, but Acero Corsa has got to have one of the best mod communities out there. I mean, how the hell do you make something like this? I'm just trying to figure out. Someone sat down and made all this, oh my god. Oh, so now we're at a different time of day and look at that. So it's now a bit less red and a bit more bluish. Oh my god. 
it looks so beautiful and with the traffic it just adds more to the immersion oh i actually wish i had vr if i had vr i would never stop playing this game i would spend literally hours in this game if i had vr oh my god is that a plane up above us is that a plane oh my god that's literally a plane oh my god this looks amazing i'm, I'm not gonna lie this looks absolutely amazing my mind is blown away just trying to process all this is absolutely insane uh this is what life's supposed to be like just cruising around in your bugatti chiron around union island oh my god this looks absolutely beautiful i can get used to this to be honest i can definitely used to get this oh uh, and with the world, it just, um, with the world, it's way more fun, I'm not gonna lie. I actually enjoyed, oh, ooh, almost crashed into that car. But this looks absolutely amazing. I think we need... Welcome back, it's now night time. Oh, it wouldn't be a magical video if we didn't drive at night. I mean, we have to, we have to drive at night. But testing out the new machinery, I'm going to say at night, it's absolutely... It's one of the most beautiful things I have experienced. So, um, I thought I would take this. I think this would be the perfect time to talk about some channel updates. Um, I've been doing this for quite some time now, and I've been having a lot of thoughts. I've been looking at the current progress, and I realized I recently hit 300 subscribers, and I actually forgot to say thank you guys. Um, it's actually being an honor being with you guys on this journey playing the game with you guys do i still want to do this is one of the questions i was asking myself recently and it's actually something i still want to do actually um i'm not quitting or anything i'm still doing but i thought i would just say thank you guys for 300 subscribers um it's been an amazing journey uh i have no idea what video just made you guys like and subscribe i mean my subscribers have been going up i have no idea which videos have been gaining a lot of traction but um for all of you who have subscribed thank you for joining the family um we hope you stay for a long time for those who haven't subbed for those who are watching who haven't subbed um welcome as well um feel free to if you enjoy the content feel free to subscribe and like um i haven't been doing this for a while a long time to be honest i think uh last month is when i actually started taking my youtube channel a bit more seriously but yeah started off at like oh my god i forgot how many subs i started with but it wasn't a lot because if you check one of my old videos my oldest video is from 2018 and up until now uh, it hasn't been a long time but thank you guys thank you and i really don't know what to say i'm just thankful for 300 subs you know i didn't think i would make it but we've made it to 300 i hope we can continue doing this and i hope i can continue doing this with you guys so that's it from me man i'll catch you guys in the next video peace out